But I think there are two levels in managing international financial crisis. One is preventing uh, the collapse of the financial system, uh, which is really an emergency uh, measure. And the second one is trying to reform the financial system after a, a, a severe, a big shock. Usually, uh, history shows that uh, whether at national or international levels, the monetary authorities, the political authorities react well. There is a, a, an instinct of uh, self-preservation and measures are taken to avoid a catastrophe. Difficulty uh, starts when you have to rebuild the financial system, to regulate it, to, to re-regulate it. And this is where international uh, cooperation has always proved too difficult, uh, or if not too difficult, at least difficult to achieve. And I think at the moment, what we should bear in mind is that uh, uh, avoid the situation where cooperation has stalled when it seemed that the catastrophe has been avoided and think that we must, uh, at any cost, not go back to a situation of new emergency when cooperation will, will be will be uh, done, but uh, uh, without a long side view. So my, my, my view about, about history is, is this distinction between these two levels and really keeping in mind the necessity after uh, avoiding catastrophe, after cooperating to avoid catastrophe, to continue uh, to make concession and, and, and cooperate in that way.